Hey everybody, welcome back for another video from Family Fun Gaming. And uh, if you haven't already done it yet, get on and uh, hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, and like, tap bell, all this stuff. Uh, you can also find us on twitch.tv forward slash video gaming family. And we started a Twitter feed, so it is twitter.com forward slash FFG Dad. So let's get into what you're here for, and that is some gameplay. All right, so this first attack, I'm just trying something different. I've seen other people do it. And it's actually an okay attack, I guess, if you're just trying to get uh, snipe some stuff off the side. I've seen people do it, and I've seen people get high percentage, even three star with this attack. But uh, so I, I decided to try it and go in there. Uh, we did get one star. But I didn't, uh, it was a over 50%. One star, I didn't get it very, I screwed up a lot. But you got to screw up, and then you got to look at what you did and try to figure out what you did wrong. So I'm, I'm putting all these archers on the outside going around and trying just to snipe off what I can, what they can get to without getting hit. And the problem comes is where I'm at now on this little corner over here. This corner over here, if I would have had to do it differently, when I brought out the king and I put him down, I would have dumped all my archers in right behind him. And I took too long. I also put the archers on the other side where I shouldn't have. I should have put them all right behind him and uh, took in that out. Maybe uh, spread them out a little bit, but at least behind there. And we would have been able to take out all that. And here's another waste of archers right there. And then I bring in my dragons. If I would have had that taken out, I could have put my dragon in, dragons in on the other side, bring them down from that side, or maybe even brought the dragons in when I was sniping, just so that way we could have those dragons to tank the air defenses away. But uh, we did pull away with a one star, so we didn't lose any trophies, and we... Uh, got plenty of loot. Uh, we got some loot. We got a star, some trophies. But uh, I mean, all in all, it wasn't bad, but definitely things we could learn about uh, about how to do a strategy like that, which I probably will never do again. Oh, I might, just for the fun of it. Now let's move on to the next one. So this next one coming up is a friendly fight between two clan members. It would be the master versus Greedy Town, and uh, just to see if uh, the Master can get in and uh, get this. So we do this right before wars, where we, we fight each other and uh, throw up uh, friendly battles so we can see where we are weakest. And uh, this is a short one. So she comes out, baby dragons on both sides, right, to start creating that funnel to the center, because we want to bring everything to the center. Now she's got those uh, P.E.K.K.A. out there. It looks like four P.E.K.K.A., four baby, and then like seven or nine wizards coming in. Bring in the king and the queen with the healers. And then we bust through that middle. And when we come in, uh, it looks like the king is taken off on a different direction. But we usually have a jump spell. Yep, there's it. They got through that middle. Rage, jump spell. Where is that jump spell? There it is, that jump spell. Get them in the middle, but that clan, those clan castle troops come out and they devastate my army. Uh, she was able to, I believe, to put down a, a poison spell. Maybe not. Maybe it's just the queens. I didn't see. But uh, now the king's inside the middle. He's clearing out the middle. So we definitely got the one star. She did not make a 50%. So she didn't get the two star, but she at least got the one star. And uh, with a regular, <clears throat> regular battle, she would have been able to get trophies. Um, I mean, if you're trophy pushing, that's all that matters is that one star to get that, to get those trophies. Uh, we don't usually trophy push. I believe it comes naturally. But that was quick. Took out that last dragon. 47%. Not very far off that two star, but almost. Now this next attack is also Greedy Town. Greedy Town changed up his base a little bit. And uh, MOS, our, one of our co-leaders of our clan, is now trying this base out. Now the best way from what I've learned in watching other people do it, the best way to get the best setup is to fight each other inside the clan. 
fight each other, see where they're weakest at, see what you can do better, and uh, change those things. Uh, the, 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 best, the best clans in Clash of Clans do this. They fight each other all the time to try to make themselves better. Now we don't have a bunch of Town Hall 12s. Uh, and we don't have a bunch of Town Hall 9s. We are, we are from Spectrum. We've got from like Town Hall 5 all the way up to Town Hall 12. So we have a huge spectrum of people on here. And we'll eventually, we're growing, but <clears throat> sorry, we'll eventually make it to, uh, to where we have all Town Hall 12s. But if you notice this base setup, so MOS started out with balloons and dragons, put all three of his uh, heroes in there, and he still wasn't even been, he wasn't even able to two star it. He got the one star. Those dragons got in the middle, and they were taken out by those hidden Teslas. So on this next one, this was uh, myself, FFG Dad, against uh, this guy, who I I don't know how to pronounce that. I'd like to know how to, but I don't know how to read any other foreign languages. But anyway, here we go. So I, I started out throwing in some of the uh, archers to try to take some out, uh, uh, just to snipe out some of the stuff that's on the corners, you know, like you do with archers. And then uh, we come in from the bottom. Uh, I believe I start off, okay, yep, there we go. I start off with the king and then a couple of giants to take hits. Uh, we throw some bombers in there that fail I looked like oh no we did get through and then threw a second set of bombers in there throw a heal spell down dump to the rest of those uh, giants at the top backing those giants up with archers at the top throw the hogs in on the right throw the heal spell down on the hogs and then the hogs split up kind of over here oh got that darn us uh, trap throwing away the hogs. It took out most of my hogs. But we got the heal spell down and then the hogs took out and it was close enough, well close enough to the mortar they didn't get hit by the mortar. The hogs take out the rest with the balloons and from here it's just clean up. Uh, wasn't a nice, I don't, I, don't, I don't think it was a nice smooth entry and exit but it did get the job done. We took the three star, <clears throat> maybe not in record time but it was a nice, I wouldn't say clean, but it was a nice win. And this next one, searching for opponent, um, I'm bringing in hogs and dragons. You can see me scoping it out, moving everything around. And uh, I believe we start from the top with our hogs. We're bringing our hogs at the top, I believe. Yep, I'm still scoping it out. There we go. There's the hog button, and yep, there we go. Start from the top with the hogs, throw down that heal spell. Hogs split up a little bit. A couple go to the right, and the majority of them go to the left. So we throw a heal spell on the left, then a heal spell on the right. Um, then we come up with the dragons. We we dropped already dropped the king at the top, taking the dragons on the top, and the dragons come down. The king will work his way down into the middle, while the dragons kind of go around the outside. It didn't work. Uh, as well as I had hoped if I would have done it if, if I have to do it again and like I said earlier and like I say in every one of our videos you got to watch what you've done before in order to perfect what you're going to do next time so we have the king up the top he's working on that elixir we have a dragon working on the town hall and then we got dragons down around the bottom but because those hogs didn't pick off that last uh, that last air defense, we did not get the three star. We did get the two star because we did end up getting that town hall. The king's getting it now. Yeah. But because of that last air defense, if I would have planned better where to put the hogs and projected where they were going to go, uh, I probably would have been able to. Uh, I, I don't think probably I would have been able to three star this. And uh, now I think we're just, it, we could do a time fail. But uh, yeah, so if I had to do it again, I would have to look more at if I have to do it again. Listen to me, I do it all the time. So I look for a better place. Sometimes I take a lot of time to figure out where it is I'm going to place my hogs just to get the most effect out of them and to keep them from getting hit. You got to remember you got splash damage and everything else that hogs 
uh, don't get, but we ended up with the two star. We got uh, quite a bit of elixir loot. On this one, we went again with hogs, hogs and dragons. Um, I do like hogs. I like hogs. But uh, um, looking at this, you know, he's scanning it out. I'm scanning it out. He, he is me. I'm scanning it out, seeing where 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 I should come in at, and we choose to come in at the right. But then I spread out the hogs. I don't know why. I think I was looking for uh, bombs. And then we threw in dragons at the top. Probably because I knew I screwed up by spreading them out so much. But they come up. They come in the middle. I throw the heal spell down. But because of all the splash damage going on, we have two mortars on us. And the king, he, my hogs are gone. My hogs are gone. We got the dragons coming down from the top. But we have those two air defenses that are just hammering on my dragons. And because of the, because of the hogs, the hogs didn't end up doing what they were what they were supposed to do, or actually they did what they're supposed to do because that's the algorithm that they're under. We were able to make we were able to make a two star. We did not get the three star and uh, that one last dragon on the right, he's going to pick off those last couple things right there. But when he moves up, he's going to get taken out. Uh, how long is it going to be? There we go. Coming down, hit the clan castle. Then he'll come down and hit the, uh, the elixir. Hey, there. We got a follower. Yep. Yeah, this is a... Uh, I do all my live streaming on Twitch. You guys know that. And... Uh, this is just a clash in the morning retakes, right? All right, so here comes that dragon down. So we got a lot of dark. We got a lot of elixir. And then once we get in range of the mortar, not the mortar, but the uh, all those, well, look at all those defenses. You got the archer tower. You got the wizard tower. You got the Tesla. And so there's the archer tower. And now the wizard tower is going to get in there. Oh, he's not in the wizard tower yet. Maybe now we will be. There we go. Now we got two things on us. And then we're going to move on. It looks like we're going to... Nope. Time fail. But we did. We got two, 200 gold, 100,000 uh, of the other. And we didn't do all that bad. Uh, but we could have done better if I would have had the hogs in there. And here we are going with hogs again. <clears throat> Getting the hogs in there. So we're on a hog kick right now. Uh, hogs are actually, I think they're fun. They're fun to watch. But uh, so where are we coming in at? So you see me scoping it out again. Ooh, where am I gonna go? Where am I gonna go? And uh, where where did we go in at? I have not previewed this one for a while, so this is off the cuff. I, I didn't even watch this one yet. I mean, after I did it, and there I go spraying hogs all over the place. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I do that. I think hogs probably work better if you keep them in the same spot. But hogs are going in. Okay, hogs on the right, they're doing their things. Hogs on the left look like they're about to get taken out. They have the king and then, yep, yeah, and I just did the last one. Yep, all the hogs are gone. Coming in with the dragons at the bottom. And uh, obviously we're not going to get, we might get a star, but we haven't got a three star. We're definitely not getting the three star. But there's that king at the top taking out those. I think definitely with hogs, you want to keep them in the same area. Spamming hogs like that isn't doesn't seem to work out like you would want it to. But uh, here come the dragons getting taken out by that Tesla, or that Tesla, that air defense. Was that two dragons now gone? Yep, two dragons by that same air defense. We have what three dragons left? Where did the other one? We had six dragons. I don't know how the other one got taken out. So I got the two dragons at the bottom, and then we have that wizard tower there taking out the other one. Uh, let's see, do we make it to where we get that town hall? It looks like it's going to be close. Come on, dragon. Take it out. Take it out. You can do this. Yes. Okay, so the dragon did take it out. We ended up with two stars. We have two dragons left coming up, so it looks like we got quite a bit of loot. We attacked this one for the dark elixir. But it doesn't look like we're going to have the time to get to that dark elixir. And by the time we get there, the the uh, air defense will probably take out my last two. These are my last two dragons. So we're getting their uh, clan castle. There's the one dragon down. 
And we got one, two after this. And this should be it. How many hits does he take? That one's holding up pretty good. And now we're in range. Boom. Gone. Two, three hits, four hits, five hits. All right. There it is for the two star. We got a little bit of loot and a little bit of stuff. Now, this will be the last battle of this. This. <clears throat> the last battle of this video. And, uh, well, I don't have anything special for you or anything. It's just another video. So we got uh, archers coming in at the top, uh, taking out some stuff, trying to uh, just take out a little bit so our our giants don't stop anywhere. Which I don't think they, do, they would anyway, but we just want to get stuff out of the way. We get those out of the way, and then those archers move up. They get taken out. I, another archer, just to see if we can get it. And then we put in a couple, a couple, like four, five giants, and then our wall bomber, and then two more wall bombers to get through that. Once we get in, then uh, I believe I put down a heal spell. Heals work awesome on giants. Heals, or like uh, Big Brother, he always does a uh, giant walk type of thing. And there I go, I accidentally put down the other two uh, heels on the right, upper right, if you've seen that. That was completely accidental. That I, I did not mean to do that. So we bring in the rest of our giants. We got healers on our giants, and the giants are going in. Unfortunately, the giants do not take out the air defense before the healers get taken out by it. And... Uh, yeah, so we had a horrible, this was horrible, horrible, horrible. But uh, we got to see it. Like I always say, you have to watch the bad ones and the good ones to learn what you got to do. But this is it for today. Thank you for watching Family Fun Gaming. Uh, you can catch us on Twitch Live at twitch.tv slash video gaming family, where we're live Monday through Friday, 6 a.m. to like 9 a.m., and then you can also see us on Twitter at twitter.com forward slash FFGDad, where we do, uh, we just have chat there, and I throw up whenever we are going to go online or whoever's playing what at what time. But thank you for watching, and if you have any comments, comment. If you have any anything you want to say, or we would like to add music at the beginning or end. So if you have any suggestions, go ahead and throw them in there. We always look. We uh, reply to most of them. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching to the end, and have a good day.